G'day, I'm Stuart from Australian Clutch. Today I'm just going to show you a particular dual mass flywheel that was susceptible to a premature failure in a vehicle. Uh, this particular flywheel is from a late model VE, VF, Commodore V8. Um, and as you can see on the outside of the flywheel, everything looks like it's pretty good condition still. Um, there's only a few hot marks on the flywheel and there's no major tapering to it. But in the vehicle, it actually causes a significant vibration because the main bearing in the flywheel had actually failed. And as you can see, there's actually quite a bit of movement in the surface of the flywheel. What this particular failure shows us is that it's important to correctly inspect all of the components before replacing a clutch kit on top of a dual mass flywheel. And it's also very important to make sure that if you're selecting a dual mass flywheel kit rather than a single mass flywheel kit, um, it's applied to the correct vehicle and correct applications.